Spokane County Sheriff now says Camp Hope needs to go and he's ready to make it happen. Sheriff Ozzie Knezovich sent a scathing letter to the Secretary of Transportation today. He says the Department of Transportation failed to address the issue in a timely manner and something needs to be done about it. This comes just as state agencies say they won't move people until there are more housing options available. Our Esther Bauer is live at Camp Hope tonight with the deadline from the sheriff. He says if this camp is still here by the middle of October, he'll start clearing it. Other state agencies are talking about building a fence here at the camp. While the sheriff wants to see it gone, some say Camp Hope isn't going anywhere anytime soon. There's no easy way to move 600 people off a plot of land, and numerous local and state agencies are already working on it. Well, the immediate next step is to get together again next week and then continue the conversation. Now, a new voice is joining the conversation. In this letter, Sheriff Ozzie Knezovich called out the Department of Transportation and Washington State for inaction and allowing this camp to grow for nine months. He says the community can no longer stand by and allow the conditions to continue. Knezovich says he'll start clearing it by the middle of next month if nothing is done. The letter from the sheriff is disappointing. Zeke Smith runs Empire Health Foundation. His team is now connecting with the people living there to see what they need. He says that work takes time and the sheriff's deadline creates trauma. All it does is increase people's anxieties. I think it actually is a safety challenge when he says something like that. Empire says they want to see a fence surrounding Camp Hope, IDs for those living there, and a possible curfew to add security. None of us believe that it's a permanent housing solution for anybody, including the residents that are there. That are there. In response to the sheriff's letter, the Department of Transportation says his proposal doesn't capture the spirit of the goals for the camp. Those already involved say the sheriff is more than welcome to offer ideas and meaningful solutions. If the sheriff wants to be a part of collaborating to how we can actually address Camp Hope and make sure that those folks can get into better housing, there's a seat at the table for him at any moment. And WashDOT tells us this property will start to look quite a bit different in the next few months. They are committed to creating a fence here at this camp. And as for what's next with the sheriff's plan, well, he will hold a press conference on it tomorrow. We'll continue to bring you the latest updates from that and what's next here at Camp Hope. Reporting live in East Central, Esther Bauer, 4 News Now.